did it feel like this was a match that you guys had to win? Well, I mean, you can look at it in so many ways, right? You can look at it, we had to win, we needed to win. I would say it's more of a need than a had because at the end of the day, right, we still got nine more games to play in the season and we're in the thick of the playoff race. And we all see, you all can look, everyone can look at the standings and one or two wins and things go nutty, right? So our focus was just to get back to our football. Our focus was just to get back to the ways that we were capable of playing and, you know, get back to even raising the level of hard work, so. Did it feel like there was any difference in the way that the guys had played that they haven't been playing the last four matches? Did it feel like there was any difference? Yeah, I mean, I think our ball possession and our pressing was really very good. And those are two core principles for us, right? And so we want to make sure that stays with us and keeps going, and that's really important for us. And obviously the fans, right? You know, we, we cannot move without saying that. So, you know, nearly 5,000 people here, and, you know, hopefully have another over 5,000 next week. So that would be great. A, a shutout win. How important was that performance from Gene, especially a little bit of struggles over the past couple of weeks? Yeah, I mean, I don't know if it's been Gene's struggles. I wouldn't, that wouldn't be fair to, to put it on him. Um, but what I would say is for us, shutouts are super important. I mean, if you don't get scored on, you can't lose. So that's, that's a simple model, right? But if you don't get scored on, you score one, you can win. But we all know one goal wins in this league are hard to come by. So we can't hang our hat on that. But we can hopefully hang our hat on getting more goals and still getting the shutout. You talked about, you know, this, this week about the importance of the team getting back to basics, returning to its identity. Did you see that tonight? Yeah, I think we did. I thought we did. I thought that um, we did especially, you know, we started the game really well. Alex's opportunity in the first half. We had some first half, first half opportunities. They didn't have a shot on goal in the first half. So those are things that are really important for us. And our possession was really high in the first half. After we scored the goal, we kind of lost our way, and then they made some, some aggressiveness that we didn't really adjust to. But the changes that we made, Minjay, Ethan, uh, Cullum, they really came on and helped us, so that was really important. You mentioned Alex there, um, you know, and they don't like calling out individuals necessarily, but what can you say about his influence this season? Yeah, I mean, Alex, we've, talk, we've talked at length about, you know, his game, if he could add, if he had goals to his game, how much his game would change. He's done, he's done that this year. So that's that's super important for us. So, look, Alex captain. He's captain for a reason. Uh, in these stretch of games, he's really been taking a lot of it on his shoulders and, and meeting with guys and meeting with the team. And so, you know, hats off to him. Jack Jacklin was uh, the season MVP for the next pro next last year. So, you know, what can you say about the back line performance? Yeah, I mean, if he was the MVP last year, I'm not sure that he'll be quiet as the season goes on. and um, But, yeah, I mean, it, they're, diff they're a difficult team to play against because they're very similar to us. They're pretty athletic. They want to keep the ball. They want to press the ball. And so, you know, it's two teams wanting the ball, and you got to figure out how the one team that has the ball, how they can keep it for longer periods of time. Lastly, there was a big reaction at the final whistle, you know, a big hug between the coaching staff. What was that moment like for you to share that with your staff? Yeah, I mean, it's good, right? Because we talk about unity within our staff because we believe if we continue to show unity within our staff, we can show uh, that, will, that, will, that energy will go to the players and create that unity, right? And, you know, we are, you know, and we want to continue that. So it's really important. Good, Jay. Not a must win, but some relief? Yeah, relief, right? Look. Even if, you, even if you're winning games, let's say we've been on a 10-game win streak and you win a game, it's always relief because the build-up to a game, no matter where you are in the standings, no matter where you are, it's because you're competitors, for us there's only one option, to win. So you walk into the game with that pressure. You know, you can, we can, we, we don't, for me, the extrinsic and that pressure doesn't come. And I try to protect that from the players. I try to take all that pressure on me and so that they can internally find themselves raised up to play at a level they're able to play. So, cool. Anything you want to add? No, just thank the fans, right? And we're super excited about getting a win. So don't 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 get me wrong. <laughs>